Welcome to this Windows and Computer channel and this is a quick uh, look at how many of you actually have right now the uh, version 2004. This is a question I get asked all the time. A lot of people have the impression that, well, you know, why I don't have it? Everybody seems to have it. Well, it's not the case according to the latest numbers. What we see right now when we look at the numbers is that 7% of all of you have version 2004. So that means the May 2020 update is on a small, not even one out of 10 users have it right now. So it's rolling out faster than last year's May 2019 update but at a slow pace still. And this is according to Add Duplex. So people that are upgrading to uh, this new version, when you look at Winver, of course, you know you have the new version with uh, version 2004 build 19041.329. Some of you have forced it. Some of you go to uh, you know their settings and go to update and security and click the uh, check for updates to see if you have that update available. So what's happening is that only 7%, so that means the majority of you out there are still not there. The majority of you, actually 82% of all of you, are on 1903 or 1909. So you're still on the 2019 versions. 80%, 82% of all of you are still on the 2019 version. So don't worry about it. Don't feel like you're the only one not getting the May 2020 update it is still the majority of people that are not there so that's the first thing you need to know and uh, i get asked that question so many times every day and uh, why don't i have it it seems it's rolling out and everybody's seeing it but i don't you don't like 80 percent of all the people out there either not checking or not doing it or simply not seeing it so it's as simple as that it's continuing to roll. So basically what's happening is that it's continuing to roll out at a certain pace. And you are going to see it at some point on your machine. Just don't worry. Once again, there's a lot of people that don't see it because you might be one of the people affected by some problem that has been discovered over time. If you are one of those, you're not seeing the... Um, May 2020 update. So don't worry. It's okay. You'd rather, it's, it's, you know, think about it's better that it takes time and eventually arrives only in a few weeks or a couple of months than it actually arrives right now, but it's plagued with problems on your PC. So the rollout, the way that it continues, is nice for that. It rolls out only to the PCs that are known to be correct. Uh, somebody was telling me, you know, why do they do that? I don't understand why they actually are doing this and why they are pushing it if there's some issues. It doesn't really matter, honestly, because they're not pushing it with issues if your PC is getting it. That's, the, that's what you got to understand is that when you upgrade to this, if you have it available through Windows Update, your... PC is okay. It doesn't have problems and there's no bugs. Well, there are bugs that are still, you know, undetected little things here and there that will be fixed over time. But what I mean is it's deemed to be safe. It's deemed to be okay. And the noise, the background noise, because that's the thing you got to look of all the people, you know, the 7% of people that actually have version 2004, the noise of people having problems is extremely low. That part, the people that do upgrade, there's only a very small percentage that are complaining something's wrong. Of course, once again, I have to remind everybody, who complains? Not the ones that are okay. They, You don't hear from the people that it's upgraded and everything's fine. You hear from the people that have problems. That's why there seems to be more problems than reality when we have a rollout. That said, yes, there are some problems, of course. The um, people that don't see it, well, you know, you might be one of those with the problems, but we also know that there's a percentage of people that don't see it just because they don't see it. 
Microsoft is not sending it to everybody at the same time. It's kind of throttling the sent, uh, the, the, the way they send it out. And once again, I want to remind everybody, if you've seen it in the past and it disappeared, it's not that they removed it, but it's that one of the problems that they have noticed might affect your PC. So it disappeared from view because of that reason, which is fine because that's the way you want the rollout. You want it to be as safe as possible. So by doing that, Microsoft is able to just target the ones that we know are okay. And slowly, as time goes by, push out the versions. And, you know, the next bug fixing updates are going to be on July 21st. I expect a whole lot of new PCs that are going to start seeing it past that date because of the fixes that they're going to bring in the operating system also. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.